motherfucker back. Kick rocks. Yeah. We had to let go of family. This is our family episode. And, and we love y'all family, but this stuff that that that, 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 it's that bullshit. Some of y'all know y'all fire. Yeah. Yeah. This is all it. But let me, let me touch on another subject. The five ass cousins you have in your motherfucking family. The five ass cousins that you wish there was in your motherfucking cousin. You know the motherfucker what I'm You got them. You got to be a family. You don't see your family reunion. Do you see a day? Like, damn, she fine as fuck. This, you know, that's your motherfucking cousin. That's not like us in motherfucking Arkansas. We can't go down to Arkansas and holler at any motherfucking thing in Arkansas. Why call it all motherfucking family? And yeah, so we about to get some ass. We with our one cousin. Let you know we go to another gay house. We well, soon we about to do something. Let you know we cousins. Man, my cousin did me. Tobias did me like that. We went to met some gay and he hooked me up and everything. And then I know both of them. Y'all, yo, cousin. He fam. I'm like, ain't that a bitch? Ain't that a bitch? But the gay didn't even know you. <laughs> I had a, I had one of my guys. Had a girl, was fucking for about three weeks, come back and find out that is his close cousin that he never knew. He took his girl over his dog on daddy's house and said, hey, dad, this is my new girl. He's like, no, no, he said, dad, look who I found. You know, he said, dad, like, ain't you my brother's daughter? Who's your brother? I am. He fucked his own first cousin, didn't even know. That's why we family, you need to stay together at uh, some points because... We don't know who we fucking. We didn't have no family reunions. We don't have no family reunions no more. Okay. Pretty, pretty, soon, pretty soon your family tree will be a straight line. Ladies of America, people, damn, ladies of America, people of America, y'all ever had a family, y'all ever had a family reunion with motherfuckers just fight? That was the hell you need. We need a family reunion just have a ring right in the middle. Just let some two motherfuckers go at it. Fuck all the talk here. Just get your ass in the ring and set it the right side. If you, if you see, if you see, you know, I won't read through history. People that fight each other have respect after after which. Look at Magneto and Professor X. Them motherfuckers hate each other's guts. Big ass fucking war and get them motherfuckers say chest with each other in, in the X Men. Ain't that a bitch? Crazy ass shit. I want me to do that shit. Cause me and my enemy right now to do that shit. I, well, okay, I can't still say that motherfucker, but still, we played football against each other. We even spoke to each other back. And we had a big ass war going on thing, well, big thing back in 95, and now we see each other. If I do see his ass, we just speak and keep on up. I don't trust that motherfucker as far as I can throw his fat ass, but what's yeah. up? So, that's just how, that's how shit is. I'm just, man, I'm just, I'm just touching on some shit. Man, 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 man. Family's all that we got nowadays, you know what I'm saying? Cause family, you know, help, you know, help you from not getting your ass whooped. It's like, hey man, we'll whoop your ass. He's like, hold up, what's your last name? Cause you say your last name, and it's like, damn, I can't fuck with you cause your family crazy. They don't come back and get my ass. You damn fucking right. Yeah, my girl was telling me the other day that back in the day, you had a fight over in St. Louis somewhere. It was three families stayed in this one, on this one street. Uh, and everybody in the family was fighting. Everybody's fighting. He had about 40 motherfuckers out there fighting. They had to shut the street down. Please just had to let them calm down. <laughs> Cause I'm like, God damn, that was a big ass fight. Big ass fight. Yeah. I, I, we I ain't that now. But it was cousins that, that pop their gum and get your ass caught up in some shit. Come on now. Yeah. You need to stay away from them motherfuckers. Cause they get you shot. Right. You be by your damn self then. The motherfuckers that you got down whooping or whatever. Surround your ass like, hey man. What's going on? Right, right, you right. You got right. scud with you now. Right, right. One of my guys had that happen to him. His brother was popping girls and that shit. He got his ass beat with a bat. That shit fucked up. Oh, your boy? Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. The Moran family. Yeah, they got fucked up. The Moran family. Y'all, y'all a who? big ass family. Moran family. Man, I'm so sorry for y'all. Y'all gotta really get to do a DNA test at the motherfucking gathering of you and your girl or you and your man right there on site. Before y'all even holler at each other, y'all gotta make sure you So a motherfucking study just to find out if y'all got cousins or not. Man, I'm sorry for that shit, man. I feel real sorry for that. But for those, I'm sorry. But man, let me tell you, I was, I was talking about being a cop one day. I was thinking about that shit. I was like, man, I could be a cop, but I wanna be a sniper, right? Cause I'll be far away from the motherfucking incident, but close enough to touch your ass. You know what I'm saying? 
No, I should be. But then I was like, okay, then they tried it, but them motherfuckers got to stay up in the motherfucking spot for like I heard it training. They got to stay in one spot for like two or three hours until they target coming to range and blast that motherfucker. So they got shit and pissed on themselves. I haven't shit and pissed on myself since last February, America. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying this shit. Oh, yeah. And then I'll be watching, I'll be thinking, I'll be the weakest ass motherfucking police officer they will possibly be. I'm, I'm, about family. Family. I'm sorry, man. I had stuff stop on. Hey, we got a motherfucker. Hey, hold on. We got, we got an office that's on police. Nah, I, 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 I won't talk about the deal. Okay, yeah. hold, on. hold on. Let me get, let me get go ahead. But I won't get done with it real quick. Uh, and yeah. I'm thinking I'll be the weakest, the weakest police officer. Why? Because doggone it, I will not, get, I will not be. The motherfucker to shut the shit down. If a motherfucker shoot and I'm around a corner, I'm running all the way back to the motherfucking precinct and let them know what. They shooting on 43rd Street. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Like, then they can shoot and I ain't going back over there, motherfucker. I'm letting you know. <laughs> shit, ain't gonna need no backup because I ain't gonna try to approach that shit. Oh, go ahead, go ahead and talk about that. Uh, I, love, I love my grandparents. Yes. I, I knew my great grandparents a little bit. You mm -hmm. know, now I love them, but, you know, because they would do some shit. Because all my grandparents grew up in the South, Mississippi and Arkansas. South. They grew up back in the twenties and thirties where where shit y'all talk about racism now. That was real crazy. shit. Right the motherfuckers then. just oh, they, they walk out the street and say what up, nigga. Now nowadays these motherfuckers will walk in their house and say what up, nigga. I seen they actually seen people hanging from trees and shit. That That's crazy about. shit. You know, your own family members they got cut them down from trees and shit. That shit. But but then you know what I'm saying. Now now she only was still alive. Uh, and man, I man she a trickster. I love my grandma, but you, 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 that white man can't jump. That's how my grandma is. Cause she had like a little old lady, and, but she will beat your ass. Don't never play dominoes with her. Don't play any kind of video game, no spades. Don't play nothing with her ass. Cause you know how spades is, you know what I'm saying? With that nigga, man, I was over my cousin's house. They was all playing spades and shit, you know what I'm saying? Getting loud and shit. You know how niggas are, you know, we getting loud. And her, she come over there, everybody be quiet and stuff, cause you know. They have respect for her. She come in, she's like, oh, y'all playing, y'all playing, y'all playing, y'all playing, y'all playing, he's like, yeah, yeah, I don't know what I'm playing, I don't know what I'm playing, a little bit. Next thing you know, she was telling a nigga, get neck, she had to say, get neck, and she was out up there in church, going out of the motherfucking cars, and dudes just playing, just was quiet as hell. At first, he was loud as fuck, you know what I'm saying? He was telling him over, telling him over his name and shit, and all of a sudden, she was out, all of a sudden, he was quiet, and his mother was like, Oh shit. <laughs> Man, I know the first time she won about Nintendo and we went to visit her. And I was in Battle Boy Combat first came out. I didn't know shit. I knew a little bit about it. I said Nintendo, man. Nintendo. Mortal Kombat was on Mortal Nintendo? Mortal Kombat was no, no, no. Sega, Sega. Sega. Okay, she had something. Sega, Sega. I know she had Mortal Kombat. And she came up and she was like, hey, you wanna play? I'm like, yeah, I, I played a little bit. So I played in the computer. She walked in. Well, I play with it. Ain't nobody else here. I play with it. Alright then. So we play a long time, but she said, I don't know what I'm doing. See, I should know right then. Uh, she picked Sub Zero. I picked, uh, uh, Ray. And I was soon, ready, fight. She froze my ass right there. I'm like, what the fuck? Walk over to me. Bam! Uppercut. Walk back. Throw me in. Uppercut. She beat me twice perfectly. And then I said, finish him. She pressed the button, dropped the truck, walked away. The ring got dropped. <laughs> And I was like, what the hell? And she did a fatality on me. I'm like, oh, I played a little bit. What the hell do you mean you played a little bit? Let me tell you something also, America. Don't, don't, don't. If you play anybody anything, whoop they ass. When they get on, when they pick up them sticks, whoop they ass. When they ass get on the court, whoop they ass. When they ass get in the ring, whoop they ass. Because you didn't want to show they ass, hey, life is not fucking easy. And shit's not giving to you. One time I was playing the 64, I was playing that No Mercy over my granddaddy house. And I was going to my little cousin, and his mama was coming there, let him win. He ain't with his shit. <laughs> I would whoop his ass like his mama should have. I whooped his ass like the white master whooped the Kuta Kente trying to make him tow it. I whooped his ass more than motherfucking police officers that whooped Rocky King ass that was on, if they was on a boat of Amistad. <laughs>
If I cheated you old fucking well. If you got cheated out by a nine-year-old man, nine-year-old little boy, you a dumbass old man. I love you though. But if you don't like what we say, or how we say it, or the way that they brought it to you, kick rocks.